Study the following information carefully and answer the question that follow. Seven different boxes namely D, E, F, G, H, I and J are having different number of articles placed in it one above the other. The number of articles is 3, 7, 10, 13, 17, 18 and 20. The following information is given below. So let us now try to read this information and write down whatever is given and try to solve the question. So what should we do here? We have to place these boxes one on top of the other and each box has different number of articles in it. So what is the first information that is given? There are two boxes between G and the box which has 13 articles. Okay. So there can be two cases. Either G can be on top of 13 or 13 can be below G. Yes, we need to know. So what is given here? There are two boxes between G and the box which has 13 articles. So either G can be on top of 13 or G can be below 13. We have to find out which is the correct way. But here if you see they have given one more information which says G lies above the box having 13 articles. So if this is G 1, 2, this will be the box which has 13 articles in it. Then next it is said that the difference between the number of articles in box G and just above G is 13. So what will be the number of articles in G and the box just above it? See look at the numbers that is given here. When you find the difference of two numbers you should get the answer as 13. So the two numbers has to be 20 and 7. 20 minus 7 is 13. There is no other possibility here. Right. So G will either be 20 and the one on top of G will be 7 or G will be 7 and the one on top of G will be 20. So you have two cases here. So let's try out both this case. The first case being where the value of G is 20 and the one on top of G is 7. The second case where G is 7. In that case, this will be 20. So I have 1, 2, 3, this is 13. Okay. See, totally I have to place how many boxes? 17 boxes are there. I have placed only 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 boxes. Two more boxes are there. Okay. So, if this is the case, right, where will be the other two boxes? So, here I have one, two more boxes. If, if I am assuming I have two more boxes here. Okay. Okay. Let us consider the first case now. I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 boxes here. Now, uh, Another information that is given here is there are two boxes between the boxes having 17 and 7 articles. So if this is 7, where will 17 be? There should be two boxes in between. See, if I assume all the remaining boxes are here on top, right? I have placed five boxes. If box 6 and 7 are here, then can 17 be anywhere on top? No, it cannot be. So 17 is not going to come there. So where will 17 be? Because there has to be two boxes between 7 and 17. So obviously if this is 7, 1, 2, this has to be 17. Then next information that is given is that G is placed below D or D is, in, is on top of G. Can this be D? If this is D, see it is also given that the two boxes are placed between D and the box which has 10 articles. So if I say this is D, 1, 2, this has to be 10, not possible. This can be D, right? If this is D, 1, 2, this can be 10. See, if I assume there was a third box here, okay, uh, above D, in that case, if, 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 sorry, not D, if there was a third box here above this box, if I assume the last box, see, out of the seven boxes, if uh, this was one case that I considered that D comes here, if D comes here, 10 would be here. Now I am assuming that there is one more box here on top. And if this was D, okay, if this was D, then which has to be 10? This has to be 10, not possible, right? So obviously, what does that mean? If this is G, there will be one box on top. After that, the box that comes has to be D. Right. See, there are only three possible places where I can place D above G. Either this can be D or this can be D or there can also be one more box above this which can be D. Now, these two cases are failing because I am not able to place 10. Okay, the box which has 10 articles. So, if this is the case which has the box, which ha this is the case where D is, then which is the box which has 10 articles? This is the box which has 10 articles. Now, there is one more information that is given that there are only three boxes between H and the box which has 10 articles. So if this is 10, which has to be H, there has to be three boxes and after that H should come. So if I'm going to put, see I've already fixed one, two, three, four, five, six boxes. I need to fix only one box. Either that one box can be here 
or here. If I fix that one box here, the difference uh, I will never get a condition where I can place a box H and uh, between box H and this box which has 10 articles there is 3 boxes in between. I will never get that. See if I put if I put this to be the last box okay. If the last box is here where will HB tell me between 10 and H there has to be 3 boxes in between. In this case 1, 2, 3 boxes are there but I have already placed the last box here. So this is not possible. This has to be H. Then only this condition is satisfied, right? There are only three boxes between H and the box which has 10 articles. That condition gets satisfied only if I place H here on top. Then next, so these are our boxes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Then it is given I is immediately below the box which has 17 articles. So this is 17, so this has to be I. Uh, then it is given D does not have 17 articles. Yes, D obviously does not have 17 articles. Only one box is there between E and J. And only one box is there between E and J. So they have to be here, right? E, J. One of them have to be here uh, in position 5. One of them have to be in position 3. Now, how do I finalize which? Here it is given the number of articles in the box. Okay, only one article is there between E and J. Then see here it is given E does not have 7 articles. So E does not have 7 articles means obviously this has to be J and this has to be E. Now we have uh, placed all the boxes so this will be F. Then next information given here is that the number of articles in the box which is just above J is less than the number of articles in J. So D will have lesser number of articles than what is there in J. So if J is 7 D has to be 3. So in that case, what is H? H is the only box that we are left with. This has to be 18. 18. And this seems to be your final arrangement. Okay. Now let us try out this case also. Obviously, this case has to go wrong somewhere. So let us try this also. So if this, this is G, right? Now again, where can 17 be in this case? 1, 2. Here I have 13. So where will 17 be? 17 has to be 1, 2 here, right? 17 has to be here. So this is G, this is 17. Now how many boxes have I fixed? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yes, we have fixed all the boxes now. Now next we have to place D. Can D be here? No, D cannot be here. Obviously it is also given D is not having 17 articles. So D cannot be here. So D either has to be here or here. Okay. So um, let us consider both the cases. First let me consider D to be here. Can D be here? No, it cannot be. Again, another condition is given to us which says I is just below the box which has 17 articles. So if this is 17, then this has to be I. So if this is I, then this has to be D. Now if this is D which is 10, 1, 2, this has to be 10. Next, it was given that there are three boxes between the uh, H and 10. So if this is 10, 1, 2, 3, this has to be H. But here already I is there. So this condition fails. So this is your correct answer. Now let us look at the questions that follow. First question, find the pair of articles and the boxes which are not correct. So which is not correct? E18 is not correct. H was in 18. I13, D3 and J7 that is all correct. Next question, which of the following condition is correct regarding the box which contains three articles with respect to H? Which is the box which has three articles? D is the box which has three articles and H is immediately above that box. So look at the options that is given. Which is the correct option? Option 2, B. Box H is immediately above the box which contains three articles. Box D has how many articles? We already found that out, right? Box D has three articles. So the answer here will be none of these. 